what is Christ consciousness? Like, what does it mean? I'm working on this big revelation I intend to share with all of you very soon, and it got me thinking. I should probably set a basis for where I'm coming from before I decode the Bible with you, right? I'm sure by now everyone has heard the term Christ consciousness. If you followed me for long, uh, you've heard me using this term for the past three years. But what does it really mean? Well, if you do a basic search on the internet, Christ consciousness is defined as a state of spiritual enlightenment or awareness of our true nature as the children of God. It's also defined as a state of intellectual development, emotional balance, as well as spiritual maturity, all of which is linked to the teachings of Yeshua ben Yosef, known today, of course, as Jesus Christ. Thus, it's our collective understanding of being born again. Let me specify, the truest teachings of Christ will include the Gnostics. Gnostics is Gnosis, and if you research what Gnosis means, it translates to knowing. This scares a lot of Christians off because the Gnostics were removed from the canon. Don't leave. I hope you stay for this journey of spiritual growth with me because it will be worth it. I simply ask you to open your minds and open your hearts so we can better understand the teachings of Christ, which I believe is precisely what the world needs right now, so we can save humanity. I was an atheist for years. I grew up angry with God. I have many friends that are still non-believers and I sincerely thank modern day religion has turned them off from seeking God, and I don't blame them. I spent many years of my life in a severe state of depression and was an avid self-medicator. I didn't want to live like that anymore. I even made an unalive attempt. And soon after, I had a dream so powerful it literally woke me up and told me to walk into the wilderness, commanding me to speak my truth from my life's experience. I chose to be homeless. And what's so satisfying is I see there are many more out there just like me, sick of suffering in a lonely world, ready to experience absolute truth and unconditional love. We must escape the beast system, my friends. That to me is what becoming heroes is all about. It's making a conscious choice to defeat our egos, to defeat our mental health disorders by living in the image of God as we were intended to do so. These are the teachings of Christ. Pick up your cross and follow me. For me, Christ consciousness is about discovering your higher self and then seeking the like-minded brothers and sisters doing the same. Collectively, we are the coming of Christ. It's no coincidence to see the emergence of artificial intelligence. There is a deep spiritual reason for this, folks. Now, for the like-minded, my friends, we are here to change the world, and you know so. And we all started this spiritual journey by changing our own perspective worlds, right? It's a beautiful thing to truly be spiritually awakened and aware. So please, for the rest of you, open your minds and hearts, and let's learn the absolute truth and seek unconditional love together. Come, let's all become heroes.